to coming of age. I mean, I really think it is a mental illness that they're destroying the nest that made them so powerful. They want to shut off our industry. They want to break up our families. They want to bring in groups that absolutely hate our culture. I mean, these really are mentally ill people uh, who I guess would come to the Christmas party and, you know, overturn the table for fun. I mean, they just seem like Grinches. Very interesting. At the meeting a couple of days ago at the Cambridge Mathematics Department, which I attended with fascination to hear the professor of physics, two other eminent professors there, and then David King. It was very interesting watching and listening to the audience. But they were, of course, very nearly all left-wing, because virtually everybody in academia, from the students to the, to the professors, is left-wing. They vote left, they live off the state, they live off the taxpayer. And... At one point, I mentioned in a very mild way that uh, the difference between the ozone hole problem and the global warming problem is the ozone hole problem had more or less got the science right. It had exaggerated it a bit, but it basically got it right. Whereas in the global warming, they've simply got a lot of the science wrong, and therefore the science isn't settled. And there were kind of murmurs of fury from all round the room. They were too polite to shriek out in, in, in the loud way that some audiences were. This was Cambridge, after all, my own alma mater. But it was very interesting, the automatic, instinctive, going along with the party line without having the faintest idea whether the party line had any scientific justification or not. And this is a feature of the left. They get every decision wrong. What you've just said is quite right. They got the DDT thing completely wrong. Every environmental scare they dream up, they're basically wrong about it. Here they are trying to coal down, close down coal-fired power stations. Our own mad climate change secretary here has announced there will be no more coal-fired power stations operating in Britain within 10 years of now. An entire industry that my heroes... The whole country was built on coal. Look at all your famous statesmen pointing that out, that... The yeah. modern UK was built on coal. Built on coal and surrounded by fish. We've now shut down the coal and we've allowed the EU to destroy all the fish. I mean, it, it's just unbelievable, the self-destructive instincts of the left, because, of course, in destroying our civilization, they destroy themselves as well. So it, it is silly. It's very sad. Well, Lord Mockton, stay there. We've got to start the next hour. We've got to start the next hour, but I, I was just...